Hey nerds, welcome to Jerry Bear Reacts. Today we're going to react to TMNT, The Last Ronin Animation. This was posted by Speedo Kagan? If I said that wrong, I'm sorry. 70k subscribers posted six months ago with 3.5 million views. The runtime is 4 minutes and 43 seconds. So if you want to watch it uninterrupted, a link will be in the description box down below, as well as links for the Patreon, Twitch stream, and everything in between. With Jerry doing his best work behind the scenes in just a few moments. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I remember when they came out and said that they were making The Last Ronin, and everybody was like, who is, like, who's it going to be? I think it ended up being Mikey. I think it ended up being Michelangelo. I can't remember for sure. But, um, yeah, that's all the information I really know about this. I'm going to hop in. And if you guys want in the comment section down below, let me know your favorite turtle. My favorite turtle? I'll tell you at the end. You can take a guess. There's only four of them. Let me know your favorite Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I'll tell you mine as soon as this uh, 4 minutes and 43 seconds is up. All right, let's hop into it. I knew this was a suicide mission. You need to end this. On my terms. For my family. Did they, the, the person that made, did you animate this? Because if it's based off the comic book, hold up. Hey, little buddy. Damn, bro, look, they got all their shit laid out. And the bandanas, too. Oh, my God, they got Donnie, Rav, Leo, Mike, everybody's shit's laying there. The sword, the stick, the nunchucks. I never know what to call Raphael's little blade things, but I never know how to remember the name. I just, it always leaves me. Fucking sword's broken, got tears falling out of the eyeballs. Cowabunga written on the, on the, the so nunchucks. I don't need this level of pain. I miss my father more than anything else. Oh. I want to make him proud. My fucking heartstrings are being just tugged on. I don't know if it's that or the amount of caffeine I've had today, but still. You can still do some damage with that sword, bro. Close up Shiv. My life. Oh, we said I'm about to Arikari this shit. I'm sorry, Father. I failed. Please forgive me. Oh God. So say was these voices in his head? Imagine laying on your back, but your head don't actually touch. You need a pretty thick-ass pillow. If you guys don't wake him up soon, I'm eating the last bagel. Hey, Sleeping Beauty. The New York bagel? Wake up. We got things to do.
let me go ahead and tell y'all something real quick that that shit right here is absolute fire for just three minutes and 44 seconds a quick little thing first of all turtles without their their headband mask thing is fucking creepy shout out the voice actors Young Leo and Raph. Oh. Damn, bro. Kill them all. Dead body in the hallway. Look at the little baby turtles. This film was dedicated to Kevin Eastman, Peter Laird, and Tom Waltz, and all the others that worked on Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Thank you very much for the joy you have given us for the turtle fans. Uh... I'm sorry that that animation was fucking flawless and beautiful when I would watch an entire movie. Thank you very much. Uh, dude. Yeah, dude, I miss my brother so much and I miss my father more than anything else. Really hit. Oh, man. That's insane. That deserves way more than 3.5 million views. My favorite Mutant Ninja Turtle, by the way, is Raphael. I've always been a big Raph fan. Uh, I like the red. I like that they always give him a do-rag nowadays with the going over his whole head. I think she's very happy. I have four magnets on my closet uh, that are Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from like, I don't know. I don't know if they were like a Burger King toy or something or they're just really old. I had I have those. And I used to have some old TMNT toys when I was a kid. And they would have different like facial expressions or different something. I don't remember what it was. But the turtle shell opened in the back and you could take the head out, flip it, push it back in and then close the shell. It was super sick. I had a lot of TMNT toys and even their big bus. And I, I just I just loved it. And it's weird because as a kid, I never watched the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But it's weird because I knew the theme song. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> Turtles in a half shell. Turtle power. And I had a bunch of toys. You just knew what they were. They were fucking Ninja Turtles, bro. It was dope. And then... I got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles video game for the Xbox 360 when I first got my 360 in like 2007. Amazing game. Super, super fun. Being able to switch between the Turtles. And then I started watching the show and I was like, this is super enjoyable. I was just a fan of just the characters themselves. And I think that's something really special when you can create a character that has that effect. doesn't matter what show they're from or not. You can make a character that's unique and that just grabs people's attention. I still have yet to watch the two new movies they came out with. I haven't watched those at all. I mean, they're not new at this point, but I still have yet to watch them to this day. And I just, uh, yeah. That's really all I got to say. I think people like Master Splinter and Shredder and all those characters are really, really fucking cool, man. And I hope uh, they, get their, they get their moment on the big screen at some point. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and head out. You guys let me know what you thought of this because I think this was amazing. And I hope they get work. And for some movies or something and VFX arts and voice acting and everything else. But for now, I'm out. Links and everything will be in the description box down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated, and I'll catch you on the next one.